Meanwhile, One America's John Hines met up with Judicial Watch President Tom Fitton to get his reaction to the scandal and has the latest from Washington. President Trump's request for an investigation into an informant sent to monitor the Trump campaign is completely appropriate and necessary. At this point, according to the president of government watchdog group Judicial Watch. Well, the Justice Department pretends it's independent. The FBI pretends it's independent of the White House. And they set up these rules to prevent White House interference or political interference in its law enforcement investigations. And that's appropriate to an extent. Uh, but when the Justice Department and the FBI are engaged in misconduct, you need outside entities such as the White House, who is supervising the FBI and Justice Department under our Constitution, the President of the United States is, uh, to exercise some oversight. And the president needs to exercise some oversight. And step up or the declassification of documents and materials as best he can and ultimately shut down the Mueller investigation, says Judicial Watch President Tom Fitton. We have to remember that the Mueller special counsel investigation began in 2016, practically speaking, uh, because that counterintelligence investigation that saw the FISA warrant abuse uh, that saw the spying, that saw this unmasking and all sorts of other things, saw the misuse of the Clinton DNC dossier. Specifically, Rosenstein handed that investigation over to the Mueller. So that's all about Mr. Mueller. And so that's why the Justice Department has been refusing to turn over information, because they've been protecting this Mueller investigation despite the incipient corruption behind it. And that corruption could include an alleged spy inside the Trump campaign. An enigmatic figure, certainly, by the name of Stefan Halper, according to Fitton. Well, it looks like Stefan Halper was used by the FBI, maybe the CIA, uh, to try to insinuate himself into the Trump campaign, maybe plant information. Uh, clearly, he was being used to spy on the campaign. And uh, we need the details of that. Uh, because it would be without precedent in American history for this to go by without an accounting. Have you ever seen anything like this before, where the, the, maybe the Department of Justice has had a spy in a presidential campaign? Nixon, maybe, where they were wiretapping the DNC, uh, but they were using operatives. They weren't even using the agencies to do so, uh, directly at least. Uh, but I don't, I'm not aware of a scandal as severe as this one. Fitton adds that the big question now may well become, what did Mueller know about Stefan Halper, and when did he know it? John Hines, One American News, Washington.